dead The whole world mad Thug life Shout out all of my MAGA base sheds Coming through the deep state I will stop the new world order But before that I'll finish walls at the border It's catchy, right? Yes. Well, Trump's legal battles inspired that rap song, First Day Out. A pro-Trump alter ego called Trump the Dawn is rapping there. It's number three on the iTunes hip-hop chart since its release last Friday. And the artist behind the song joins us now. Jesse Friedman, also known as rapper Hi Res. Great to see you. Um, I love the lyrics, Jesse. How long did it take for you to put this together? Uh, thanks so much for having me, first off. Uh, it took me about uh, 30 minutes, 40 minutes. Uh, wow. Just my homie, Patriot J, he contacted me and uh, he said, yo, you got to do this. There's this thing in, in hip hop called First Day Out where a lot of artists basically rap about getting out of prison or getting out of jail. And it was just totally like meme worthy where, you know, I wanted to put this little political spin on it. And there was no time in history that I was able to do that in the past. And uh, so it was just a, it was a perfect opportunity. And you are a rapper. You're very talented. Um, you, you also have a connection to Trump. You got married at Mar-a-Lago. So tell us about your relationship and, and why you feel connected to to do this and support him. Yeah, so, uh, you know, just like a lot of people, I never really connected with um, any party. Um, I grew up in a household that was pretty left-leaning, but um, I never really was a Republican or a Democrat. I was pretty apolitical most of my life. And uh, Trump, I feel like, speaks to a lot of the vast majority in the middle, uh, whether it's libertarian or left-leaning or right-leaning. Um, he feels like, I feel like he speaks to a lot of this disenfranchised people that aren't really for, you know, uh, you know Republicans or necessarily uh, liberals. And I feel like he just speaks for, you know, the majority of the people. And, um, yeah, I got married in Mar-a-Lago to my beautiful wife. And uh, it, just, it just felt like it really topped off the last few years of um, protesting against mandates and lockdowns. And uh, it really all came together. So it was a beautiful wedding. And you know, I got to tr talk with Trump a few times and see him around and it started becoming really funny where I just kept seeing him, you know, all over the place. Do you have a favorite lyric out of the song? <clears throat> I love the song. I love the line of orange man bad, the whole world mad. So it's just it's just a funny I don't know. It came to me and it was funny. So <laughs> I think that's the clip we just heard, too. So our <laughs> editors really love that as well. And hi, Rez, we wish you uh, continued success. It's a catchy tune. Maybe some people are making it their ringtone now, I think. So we'll be watching your career. Thanks so much for being with us today.